over towards the far side, the blue and yellow of French. In the centre, little clarinet with the yellow cap. Early call coming there in the red and yellow. Outside him, Nick Bay, master speaker, trying to improve down the far side. Heading onto the furlong pole, French, little clarinet. Nick Bay coming there, stand side with early call. And over on the far side, master speaker. Well inside the final furlong, and Nick Bay has come through to lead. And going on from French, master speaker. As they go to the line, Nick Bay wins well from French. Close for third between Little Clarinet and Master Speaker ahead of Early Call. Over towards the far side, the blue and yellow of French. In the centre, Little Clarinet with the yellow cap. Early Call coming there in the red and yellow. Outside him, Nick Bay, Master Speaker, trying to improve down the far side. Heading onto the furlong pole, French, Little Clarinet. Nick Bay coming there, stand side with Early Call. And over on the far side, Master Speaker. Well inside the final furlong, and Nick Bay has come through to lead. And going on from French, Master Speaker, as they go to the line, Nick Bay wins well from French, close for third between Little Clarinet and Master Speaker ahead of Early Call. The King of Kells in the centre of the course, over on the far side, Kitten on the keys, behind him Seb Star in blue and yellow, and then Tinkerbell's effect, the leading quartet inside the final furlong. Top weight, the King of Kells with a three-length lead over Kitten on the key, staying on the Enchanted One. Over on the far side, finishing well is Miss Sassy Boots, but King of Kells will win well from Enchanted One second, Miss Sassy Boots third, followed in by Tinkerbell's effect. It's the King of Kells in the centre of the course, over on the far side, Kitten on the keys, behind him Seb Star in blue and yellow, and then Tinkerbell's effect, the leading quartet inside the final furlong. Top weight, the King of Kells with a three-length lead over Kitten on the key, staying on the Enchanted One. Over on the far side, finishing well is Miss Sassy Boots, but King of Kells will win well from Enchanted One second. Miss Sassy Boots third, followed in by Tinkerbell's effect. Spread across the track, Varna Gold, Abbey Hatcher the outside, between them Cardinal Rule towards the near side, Gold Brocade. Spread across the track, inside the final furlong, Varna Gold still there in the centre. So Suave coming home well towards the far side. Well inside the last hundred yards and So Suave has taken over and goes on to win for Johnny Murta and Niall McCullough. Up for second is Algeria and in third spot Varna Gold. Spread across the track, Varna Gold, Abbey Hatcher the outside, between them Cardinal Rule towards the near side, Gold Brocade. Spread across the track, inside the final furlong, Varna Gold still there in the centre. So Suave coming home well towards the far side. Well inside the last hundred yards and So Suave has taken over and goes on to win for Johnny Murta and Niall McCullough. Up for second is Algeria and in third spot Varna Gold. Out in front, Toffee Galore, Joey Sheridan, tracked by Muta Dowell in the black and red colours, Gavin Ryan. The grey honour oak coming between horses, Count of Carabas, over towards the far side, fit for function, trying to stay on. Less than a furling and a half to race, and Count of Carabas hits the front. Muta Dowell is second, down the outside, Musbid is staying on, but Count of Carabas leads, Muta Dowell the far side in second. The near side, third, Musbid, with less than 100 yards to race, Count of Carabas and Chris Hayes will win it by less than a length to Muta Dowell, Musbid third, and a break to beleaguerment in fourth. Out in front, Toffee Galore, Joey Sheridan, tracked by Muta Dowell in the black and red colours, Gavin Ryan. The grey honour oak, coming between horses, Count of Carabas, over towards the far side, fit for function, trying to stay on. Less than a furling and a half to race, and Count of Carabas hits the front. Muta Dowell is second, down the outside, Musbid is staying on, but Count of Carabas leads, Muta Dowell the far side in second. The near side, third, Musbid, with less than 100 yards to race, Count of Carabas and Chris Hayes will win it by less than a length to Muta Dowell, Musbid third, and a break to beleaguerment in fourth. Confident Kid, Ask Delaney, Rippling Waters with the Noseband, just behind them, Pegasus Bridge. Also behind them, Moon Fallot in yellow and black colour, switch to the outside. Mazzoli trying to stay on, Fashar also staying on behind them. Heading onto the furlong pole, Rippling Waters, tackling Confident Kid, Moon Fallot towards the near side. Fashar coming through in the centre. Well inside the final furlong, Moon Fallot on the stand side has come through to head Rippling Waters, staying on well on the far side is Sharg, but Moon Fallot wins, close for a second between on the far side, Sharg, near side, Rippling Waters. Confident Kid, Ask Delaney, Rippling Waters with the noseband, just behind them, Pegasus Bridge. 
Also behind them, Moon Fallot in yellow and black colour switched to the outside. Mazalai trying to stay on. Fashar also staying on behind them. Heading on to the furlong pole, rippling waters. Tackling confident kid, Moon Fallot towards the near side. Fashar coming through in the centre. Well inside the final furlong, Moon Fallot on the stand side has come through to head rippling waters. Staying on well on the far side is Sharg, but Moon Fallot wins close for second between on the far side Sharg, near side rippling waters. Lady and Lavender trying to pick up around the outside. We're heading on passing the two. Mulzam tackled by Prime Chief towards the outside Solomon Seal. Hapog in the pale blue on the extreme left. Suntory Times and Lily Lily Rose trying to challenge over on the far side. Heading on now to the furlong pole. Lily Lily Rose has come through with Suntory Times. Hapog near side with Solomon Seal. Deira is staying on well. But Lily Lily Rose and Suntory Times fight it out. Finishing best of all, Deira, but as they go to the line, a double for Chris Hayes. Lily Lily Rose beats on Tory Times, Deira, and a break to Hapog in fourth. Lady and Lavender trying to pick up around the outside. We're heading on passing the two. Mulzam tackled by Prime Chief towards the outside Solomon Seal. Hapog in the pale blue on the extreme left. Suntory Times and Lily Lily Rose trying to challenge over on the far side. Heading on now to the furlong pole. Lily Lily Rose has come through with Suntory Times. Hapog near side with Solomon Seal. Deira is staying on well. But Lily Lily Rose and Suntory Times fight it out. Finishing best of all Deira. But as they go to the line, a double for Chris Hayes. Lily Lily Rose beats Suntory Times. Deira and a break to Hapog. And fourth. Turf range coming out there over on the far side. Heading on now at less than a furlong and a half to race. Turf range the far side. Challenged by Spelga near side and they move on. Well inside the final furlong. Towards the far side, turf range. Spelga near side. They fight it out. Clear of the faithful Indian as they go to the line. Spelga getting up will win for Shane Foley and Michael Halford. Turf range second. In third spot was the faithful Indian, followed in by attack at dawn. Turf range coming out there over on the far side. Heading on now at less than a furlong and a half to race. Turf range the far side. Challenged by Spelga near side and they move on. Well inside the final furlong. Towards the far side, turf range. Spelga near side, they fight it out. Clear of the faithful Indian as they go to the line. Spelga getting up will win for Shane Foley and Michael Halford. Turf range second. In third spot was the faithful Indian, followed in by attack at dawn. Garaman, early strike, Alice Milligan down the outside, Pack Army is just behind him in the yellow and black colours. Munajat switched towards the far side with Karanda also staying on as they head onto the furlong pole. Pack Army has come through in the centre. Near side, Yaraman and early strike, they show out in front. But Pack Army with a couple of lengths lead, Karanda staying on well, over towards the far side. But Pack Army and Rory Cleary going on to win the finale. From Karunda second, early strike third, Yaraman four, Munajat in fifth. Yaraman, early strike, Alice Milligan down the outside, Pack Army is just behind him in the yellow and black colours. Munajat switched towards the far side with Karunda also staying on as they head onto the furlong pole. Pack Army has come through in the centre. Near side, Yaraman in early strike. They show out in front, but Pack Army with a couple of lengths lead. Karanda staying on well, over towards the far side, but Pack Army and Rory Cleary going on to win the finale from Karanda second, early strike third, Yaraman four, Munajat in fifth.